gonna do, um, I think I did in a separate video that there was gonna be a Pokemon Z. Um, and with Pokemon Z, I kind of resemble to Diamond and Pearl, which then resembles the Platinum. So it's kind of the same thing here. This time, just X and Y and then Z. So this is the new legendary for Pokemon Z, and it's not released yet, but it's gonna be released like next year. And that name is Zygrade. And, or is it Zygra, Zygra, Gardy, or is, no, I'm pretty sure it's Zygrade. But Zygrade is the new uh, mythical, well, not mythical, but it's a new legendary, and this is kind of a snake thing. Um, I can see it's, it's being resembled to Nordic stuff, like, um, you tell it's like the thing who, like, evil and all that, well, Alexander is like the thing who protects all this, and then the snake, which is like, um, who, who's like, talking about hell and the heaven and all that but um this is the new legendary pokemon its name is zygrade there is no um possible typing for that but but um it is a new pokemon and it's kind of snake so um it's okay i guess i don't know if i should just get Z the way it looks but i think so so guys i am back and i'm gonna give you guys some new information and this has to do with elite four Yesterday I did a video on um, the gym leaders and, and um, their typings and all of that. And this is going to be doing with Elite Four. So first Elite Four member is Wickstrom. Wickstrom is a new uh, Elite Four and he is a steel type. I'm not really sure if he ever had um, a steel type uh, Elite Four before. Um, if we did, um, my bad. If we didn't, losers. Second Elite Four is Malva. Malva is a fire type. She looks um, like a dark type, but I'm considering she is gonna be some type of dark type Pokemon because just the way the appearance looks. But she is a fire type, and yeah, she's fire. Considering we had many fire types before, like Elite Four, like Flint, and then before that, I'm pretty sure there's another one before that. But um, I'm not really in favor of this because we already have many fire types, so. Yeah, I guess. This is Drasna, and she is the dragon type Elite Four. It's really surprising because um, usually the dragon types are the champion, like in most games. Like Cynthia, she had a Garchomp, and then like Lance, he had like a bunch of dragon types. Like, but in this case, she is an Elite Four member. She's the third Elite Four member, yet, and uh, yeah, I'm in favor of this because we never had a Elite Four member who's a dragon type, so it's a good idea. And the final Elite Four that we have to be facing is Seabold. Seabold is water type and I know um, we barely have any water type um, Elite Fours considering most of them are gym leaders but I'm in favor of this because it's a water type and I'm really excited to see what's going to happen. So here is the new champion and her name is Diantha and she is the, well, the Kalos region champion. And she does not have a certain type, like some of the other ones, just like Cynthia, but she does have um, a one mega Pokemon, and I'm gonna give you guys, these are spoilers, guys. I'm gonna quickly tell you what her Pokemon are, so I'm gonna give you a sec. If you don't wanna be spoiled, I would recommend you leave right now. So guys, I just gave you f a few seconds, so, for the guys who, st for the people who are still watching this video, the new um, Pokemon that she is going to have are... So as I said again, she has one Mega Pokemon in her team. I'm not sure which one it is, but she has one. I, I'm i pretty sure I know what it is because there's a new Mega Pokemon that happened. That... Sorry guys, I probably should have said that um, I was having, I just had to go have some lunch. But um, I'm back, and as I say, as I was saying, um, yeah, Champion Diantha has one Mega Pokemon in her team, and we, nobody knows what it is yet. But her team currently um exists of uh, Hawklucha, uh, the new bird Pokemon thing, Tyrantrum, um, which is awesome. I like, I love Tyrantrum. Gudra, which is a new Dragon type, which I'll talk about a bit later on. Gorgeous, which I don't know what it is. It's probably just gonna be released like, like a few days from now, I guess. Gardevoir, um, I'm gonna talk more in detail about that if you guys already know the news. But for you, if you don't, I'll talk about it anyway. And Aurorus as well, which is okay. So that is that consists of a team. 
And I know the Mega Pokemon is going to be, it is going to be Mega Grad War and that has been released and I'm going to be talking about it now. So guys, now we are he here at Mega Guard War and this is the new and improved uh, Mega Guard War. Okay, just, well, never mind. And technically or personally, in my own opinion, again, it's my own opinion. If you have your own opinion, you can leave in a comment. Um, I don't really like this. The only difference is just the, the chest, the pink thing, it, com it came in further. The head, the kind of added more like, spikes and stuff. And then what kind of... Is that like supposed to be a skirt or something? It's huge and doesn't look that good. So, but it is still keeping its um psychic and fairy, because Gardevoir has been a fairy type now, so it is psychic and fairy. So, yeah, I don't really like this Pokemon. So, guys, recently on Twitter, um, I've been tweeting out some new pictures of new Pokemon that have been released, and I tweeted out a picture of Noibat, which you guys probably know about already. If you didn't. If you guys can like follow me on Twitter, and um, that'd be great. If you, if you guys want like first class and um, pictures and spoilers of new Pokemon stuff, uh, you can follow me as well. But other than that, this is Noibat. It's a seven way Pokemon, and it is a de evolution of Noivern. And I'm definitely gonna have this on my team because I really, really like Noivern the way it looks. But anyway, it is flying a dragon, and it is a seven way Pokemon. It um. Even a, rust, even a robust wrestler will become dizzy and unable to stand when exposed to its 200 hertz ultrasonic waves. So the only problem with this is just it kind of reminds me of um, Wubat or Zubat or um, a, a, you know, just like those basic bat Pokemon things. So that's the only default but um, I think the evolved form is more unique and looks really cool and I really like this Pokemon. So guys, a new picture has surfaced via Twitter, and it is on my Twitter as well, the pic, so if you guys want to check it out. Um, this is um, a new Pokemon trainer, and his name is AZ. Um, no details on this, except he was found in um, one of those like, desert things, and he was talking about uh, Flabebe and all that, so that's the only thing we got know about him, and that he's mysterious. Um, it, it's probably something to do with the story, when we actually get the game, you noticed. Considering people already got the game earlier, um, they are leaking all these pictures out. But um, I'm fine, I guess. But uh, it's cool. But the only problem with this guy is it looks way too freaky, and this is like seven plus game. So I'm not sure if how it's gonna turn out. But it's on the other side, it's actually really good as well because if you like, we should have one of those mysterious Pokemon like. I'm just speaking so fast. We should have one of those mysterious um people in like each game. So. Great to see him here. I don't know what he's going to do. I feel like he's going to work with Team Flair. Just have a hint like that. Kind of like N and all that. So that's the only thing I... I well, that's the thing I, I'm thinking about. Also, guys, a new Pokemon has uh, been revealed. And that new Pokemon is Heliolisk. The evolved form of Heliopetile or something like that. Looks pretty cool. Um, I'm really eager to see his final evolution. I feel like it is going to have one. And on the other side, you can see Chest, not the Chest and Final Evolution, which is my favorite so far. And Froki uh, second, Fennekin looks really bad, but um, I tweeted out a picture of Fennekin and its stats and typing as well. If you guys want to check that as well. And other than that, this Pokemon looks really cool. Be it. So guys, a new picture has also surfaced via Twitter, and this is called Clawitzer. And Clawitzer is the vault form of uh, Clockter or something, and it has the Mecha Launcher thing. Which fires up uh, aura and pulse moves, so like aura beam or aurora beam or something like that. So they get powered. Uh, I like this Pokemon uh, more than the other one. Um, the stats are pretty good as well, just ex except speed. So it's really, I guess, it's gonna be more bulkier. But you can get this in Pokemon. Oops, God, um, I just wrapped my keys. But I think you can get this in Pokemon X and in Pokemon Y. You, you get the. Scrap and the other one. So let's just go quickly check out Scrap's final evolution. So guys, this is Scrap's final evolution. You probably have to turn around to see it, but this is Scrap's final evolution. It looks horrible. Really hate it. That's it, guys. Also, um, if you guys remember Diggers by which I did a video on, um, it is now normal and ground, and it's pretty cool. Um, it's really cool, and I'm gonna quickly show you a cool picture of it. You go, Diggers boy. Oh, if only I was Jigger's Spy, that'd be awesome. Oh. So this is Zygrade, and it's Dragon and Ground, as they already said. Um, you know, 
it, it's pretty defensive and that's the main thing about it, I guess. And the final, final thing I want to talk about, guys, is a Mega Me 2Y. And I just want to show you its stats if you guys are going to get Y. It is pretty much a sweeper. Um, it's, it has a good high attack and special attack, but it's kind of like Infernape in a way. It can't take too many hits, but it's a sweeper. If you use right, you, you, you do go with it. So guys, the final thing I want to talk about is Gudra, as I said. Gudra is the new dragon type Pokemon. It is really special defensive and has low attack stats, so it's just a bulky Pokemon, I guess. It's kind of like Altaria. I think it's going to be a bit of a disappointment because the speed's really bad. The special attack's decent. The attack's decent. The defense is really bad. But it has um, hydration, so if it's raining, it'll get healed up. But with that saying, I don't think I would get this Pokemon anymore. Because I think my expectations went down a bit. So guys, that has been for this little update video. It's probably a bit long, but um, I hope you guys enjoyed. It's just pretty much all the facts and all everything that's been released this this week. And there's still more, but I don't want to make it too long. So I'm just, I just took the most impor important parts. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please click that like button. It really helps. And subscribe as well. That helps as well. Um, if you guys want to follow me on Twitter for more pictures and spoilers and stuff like that and X, y, and, X and Y related, uh, that's okay, fine with me too. Um, leave a comment if, for your favorite Pokemon. Um, I think my favorite Pokemon has to be uh, Noivern. I think it's really cool, so I'm in favor of Noivern. And uh, that's it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. My name's Ultimate Pokemon 7. And I will see you guys next time for more Pokemon X and Y spoilers. Thanks for watching, guys. See you. So guys, just before I go, I want to just quickly say there's going to be a few trailers after this. There's going to be two trailers. The first one's going to be an anime trailer uh, with the X and Y, which is a new one. The second one's going to be some gameplay X and Y uh, trailer. So um, please uh, stay tuned for that if you are still interested. It's just after this little uh, commentary. And also, uh, please hit that like button. Follow me on Twitter. And hope you guys enjoy those and two little trailers. And subscribe for more as well. Thanks, guys. I hope you guys enjoy it. Pokemon Morning News! Kore kara Pokemon de asobu kata mo, mo sude ni Pokemon de asobu deiru kata mo, ohayou gozaimasu. Kesa mo Pokemon Morning News o Nakagawa ga o stai koshimasu. Sai shin anime Pocket Monster XY. ポケモン世界征服を企む サトシとピカチュウの新たなる冒険をお楽しみに。第1回目の放送が楽しみですね。来週はポケットモンスター XY のお得な情報をお届けいたします。以上、ポケモンモーニングニュースでした。<笑>